Alright y'all, I'm out here in the yard. We're getting some uh some gust of wind that's coming around. This is in the front of my yard. There's the trees and stuff. Here's out behind the house, the lake. But as you can tell, we're starting to get some of that wind coming through, gusting through here. Sit there in the trees. Just kind of showing you what's going on down here in Frostproof, Florida. It's starting to get super windy out here, y'all. I feel like uh, I got off the weather channel. The wind's kind of a steady wind, and then we'll get big gusts that uh, blows through and stuff like that. But it's coming from the the wind's coming from like the northeast, coming across. As you can tell, you can hear it. Y'all see them? See the trees and shit? I mean, it's and this is early. The the storm ain't even the storm ain't even nowhere near by. So we're just getting As you can hear the wind, it's like steady, and then we'll get these big gusts that come through and uh, stuff like that. Well, we got everything tied down and put up and stuff like that, but we'll see what we're gonna do. I didn't talk to the neighbor this morning. He said, uh, if we need anything, he's there. And I told him if he needs anything, we're here. And hopefully we'll be all right. They said the they say the, the hurricane's at a Cat 4, which is 155 mile an hour winds. Looks like it's gonna come through, uh, you know, over by Fort Myers and up, up that way, Sarasota area, it looks like where it's gonna go, but we're getting a little bit of rain. The rain ain't real bad right now. We're getting little drizzles off and on, this and that. Here's oak tree right here in my driveway, you know, but as you can tell, you know, you get them, you get them big gusts of wind. You know. Through here, you know. So it is blowing around. So hopefully we'll be all right. All you can do is prep as best you can and pray for the best. You know, but the people that live in them trailers right there, I don't know if I'd be in them trailers right now when that storm comes through. They say the eye and the, and the storm's supposed to get up by us uh, tonight. You know, late tonight, so. Which, that's the scary thing is, you know, when the storm's coming through where you're at at night time, that's kind of the scariest time because you can't really see nothing. And you hear sounds and you hear creaking and you hear them limbs popping and stuff. You know, but as you can tell, see that wind? See, we got a gust right there. Trees going crazy over there, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, that's what you got to deal with. If you live in Florida, this is something we deal with a lot. So we're, we're kind of used to it. There's always, you know, first time for everything. But what can you do? You know? Pretty good sized trees right there getting it, you know what I mean? That's good getting it. I don't know how fast the wind's moving out here, but there's gusts that's got to at least be. Stacy right there, y'all. <laughs> She's the weather lady. I am. <laughs> the weather lady. <laughs> I'll show you down where the water's at. We're gonna come back here. Now the water level's already high in my lake I live on. So that's kind of one thing that's got us worried a little bit. I mean, as you can see, you can see where that water is up to our seawall. And right here, you know. I mean, you gotta figure, we got that much seawall to the top of it. And then if you just pan around this way, and look, that's where our house is. So, right on the damn lake. So, we're kind of scared of the water, <laughs> you know, getting up too high. But we got a little bit of, we got a little bit before it gets up to the wall. Okay, there's 
old boat tied off. I double tied everything on that boat. And uh, hopefully it'll be all right. That wind's kicking, y'all. Y'all can see it. The little palm trees out here, they're blowing like crazy. And the tree over here, the oak trees. I mean, you don't know where to, that's the thing about it. You don't know where to park stuff and move stuff around to. Like I was telling mom, I said, you can move that. I could move my truck over there in the middle of the yard and then something blow over there and tear my truck up. So you, you pretty much don't know where to put stuff. You pretty much just do the best you can and hopefully nothing happens and you make it, you know, you make it through it without your stuff getting tore up. But that's the way it goes. We got everything, got that tied up real nice. We got every, the, all the tables and stuff up there put inside the Florida room and table turned upside down and tied up boat all tied up real tight I got two big clevises the one of the clevis just one of them alone weighs about 100 pounds so I dropped it in the water put rope on it so now I got two clevises out here with the ropes tied to the back of the pontoon boat and they're in the water and they're super heavy and you got rope on them and then around the front of the pontoon boat I've got a uh, Two ropes right there hooked up to that four by four now that four by four used to be dry land and as you can tell we've got so much rain over the last couple weeks you see that grass is down there that's like the edge of the grass that's where the water was the edge of that grass right there and now look how much it's came up within the last couple weeks so as you can see the seawall is only that high so we got probably I'd say about 20 inches to the top of that seawall from the water so maybe we'll be all right y'all you know you don't never know um but yeah we're getting getting some weather some winds and stuff little winds coming through water swirling around out there but just want to make a video i'll keep y'all updated i'll make more videos if i can and uh kind of show you what the weather's doing they, they pretty much saying this thing is headed right towards us here in Central Florida and Polk County. If you want to look it up, look up uh, Frostproof in Polk County. That's where we're at. And uh, we're right on Lake Silver. And uh, you can see where we're at. They say it will drop down. About the time it gets to us, it will drop down. But even even a, a, a one or a two coming through here isn't, isn't very good for us. I mean, it's, and that it's coming at night time or early in the morning. And that's gonna be a scary thing, you know, being nighttime. But you know, we got a lot of people praying for us out there, and uh, hopefully, we'll make it through it. And uh, you know, but the it's funny because it's like one minute everything's real nice and calm, and then the wind starts blowing a little bit, and then all of a sudden you get these big gusts about knocks you over. But hopefully, we'll be all right. You know, so it's something else, y'all. All right, just making a video. Holler at y'all later. Say some prayers for us. Thank you.